Uh, I'm Felix Klinkhammer, I'm 28 years old, fighting out of London shoot fighters. I played football from a young age, then when I was 21 I got into mixed martial arts, joined London shoot fighters and now I'm here. I'm really excited uh, to fight for Ares, seems like a very good promotion, good fans, French, French people, great, uh, great crowd, so I'm really looking forward to performing on the 11th. We've uh, been focusing on making sure that he's in peak performance, uh, ready for the fight. So covering, in, covering all areas, so working on his explosive power, strength work, speed work, just making sure he's in the best shape possible. We pretty much are in training camp all year round. Um, we, obviously we got this uh, fight on two weeks notice, but we try to stay ready all the time. So we jumped on the opportunity and that's it. He's in amazing shape, it's the best shape he's ever been in. So. Um, like I said, we've left no stone unturned. Everything's been covered. Um, he will be in the best shape possible. Basically, obviously, like you can see, I live right by the gym. Gym is over there. Um, that's all I do pretty much. I just train full time. Even when I'm not training, I'm in there watching other people, like the other Jiu Jitsu classes, striking classes take place. I love just being in the gym 24 7, fully immersed in what I'm doing. And I go out to the woods sometimes, just like to chill. But apart from that, I this gives me the ability to just focus on the fighting fully and pretty much this is my life from here to there that's where I spend most of my time it's definitely choice like I choose to live here in the van um, I think I'm fortunate enough I, I, I could stay in a flat but I feel like it'll just the van gives me the perfect amount of being uncomfortable whilst being comfortable. It's not disturbing my training, but also keeps me, I feel like, that grit you need as a fighter keeps you hungry. And uh, that's why I, I yeah, I just, I, I love it. Like, obviously, if you look around, like, this is it's not the nicest place, and I prefer nature 100%. And a lot of stuff goes down in this car park at night. Like a lot of noise, a lot of partying. Um, but I wouldn't trade it, just because it just makes me who I am, and uh, yeah. Felix is very well matched with lots of guys. If the guy's a good kickboxer, we can kickbox with him. If he's good jiu-jitsu, we can go on the ground with him. We can do what he doesn't want to do and what he wants to do. I think Felix has got a very good blend of, uh, of MMA. So um, we're just looking forward to fighting. I think it's been a long time with, uh, with COVID and with all the restrictions and stuff. Now everyone wants to fight, everyone's ready. Um, this show now, uh, Aries Fight, is, uh, seems like a very good opportunity, a very good show. So we're happy to perform and work hard and, uh, and, and, fight, and fight well.
The beast mom's a grab, let's go, hop, jump. <laughs> I think it's going to be added to his list. I think um, I don't think the guy survives uh, 50 minutes, and if he does, then he's a good fighter. And I respect to him, and I respect to his team. But Felix is a real, real tough guy, and he's going to try and finish the fight, which is what we want. But um, maximum respect to his opponent and his team, and I'm sure they're preparing very, very hard. So we look forward to a, a very good show, and uh, on the night, the best man will win, which is uh, which is all we want. I've watched all his fights, he seems like a powerful puncher. Doesn't move much, but obviously dangerous on the feet. Everyone's dangerous in four-ounce gloves. I think I've, uh, I've got better movement than him. Um, I, I, I do see that I'm the favorite on the ground, for sure. Um, it's just whether he can find me and connect with his big right hand, but I don't think, I don't think he will. I predict the finish. Round two. I don't really have a message for him. No. 